Well, once again, what we're seeing with the recent elections in Morocco is uh, the Kingdom of Morocco continues its march on the road to democracy. These elections obviously come after this new constitution that was voted on by a majority of the people of Morocco last July, following uh, a very historic speech by His Majesty King Mohammed VI in March of last year. Uh, what we're seeing is a continuation of a, uh, a uh, of a process in which uh, there are new reforms going on and more openness in the field of economics and in the political sphere and in the social development sphere as well. These reforms, as, you, as we many of us know, started more than a decade ago uh, with, uh, with the beginning of uh, change under uh, this king's father, King Hassan II, and was speeded up by King Mohammed VI. We saw big changes starting in 1998 when the first uh, opposition government in several years came in, uh, and it was followed by many reforms on women, um, on the press, and other kinds of openness uh, issues that were addressed uh, and uh, in the course of the last decade. So uh, today uh, what we're seeing is more of that and we hope uh, on Thursday to um, talk about these issues in a forum that will address uh, where Morocco has been but more uh, where Morocco is headed.